We're back this week in conjunction with the Make-A-Wish Foundation. ESPN is once again turning sports wishes into reality for children battling serious illness as part of our series, My Wish. Last year, this Colorado soccer fan cheered for the U.S. World Cup team from his hospital bed during his fight against leukemia. When he gets to practice with his favorite player, the result is good fortune for everyone. If you're looking for seven-year-old Brendan Galano, most afternoons you can find him in the backyard of his family's home in Lakewood, Colorado, scoring some goals, going against his father one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah, I beat him every time pretty much. Dad, get into that goal. You're going down. It was spring of 2010 when his parents saw Brendan develop a severe contusion after lightly bumping his head. He just brushed the side of our door and he got like this big bruise and knot on the top of his head. And I was like, now that's weird. So I thought maybe we better get that looked at. The bruising was a sign of something more serious. At the doctor's office, the mood turned solemn. What did they tell you? Uh, we think your son has leukemia. You automatically think the worst. You know, are we going to lose our son? Brendan would spend most of the next eight months in the hospital undergoing rounds of chemotherapy. We were at the museum and um, a mom and a child were looking at him and staring at him and the, the mom said, oh, I'm so sorry, is your little boy sick? And Brennan just looked up to both of them and said, no, I'm not sick, I just have cancer. And I thought that was the best answer. He made it easier for all of us, he really did. I only wish I had it, the spirit that he has. What kept him going was his family and the FIFA World Cup. We didn't miss a single 5.30 a.m. game. He would wake me up every morning to make sure that TV was on and that we were watching the games. On the wall of his hospital room, there was a World Cup pool posted. One team and one player was his favorite. One day, a phone call pulled Brendan's dad out of a meeting. It turned out to be Brendan announcing to me that Landon Donovan just scored in the 91st minute. Can they do it here? Cross and Dempsey is denied again, but Donovan has scored! Oh, can you believe this? Go, go, USA! Landon just scored, Landon just scored. Landon Donovan is back with his MLS team, the LA Galaxy. He's the person Brendan would most like to meet. On this day, Brendan thinks he's getting new soccer cleats, but while he's trying them on with his dad and his sister Brianna, out comes a box with a DVD inside. Lay me first, is that what that says? What's up, Brendan? It's Landon Donovan from the LA Galaxy. I wanted to know if you and your family wanted to come hang out with me and the LA Galaxy here in LA. And those cleats? They're a gift from Landon. I thought these would be useful when you come to see me in the galaxy this week. Wow. I want to see everything these can do. Go. Go. <laughs> I'm going to get these. Days later, Brendan and his family are taking a limo to Carson, California site of the Galaxy's headquarters. Hi, Brendan. I'm Tom Payne, the president of the Galaxy. How are you? Good. He's whisked to a special locker room where a personalized jersey awaits him. Someone stops by to say hi. Hey! I'm Landon. How are you? Good. Have a seat, dude. Don't be shy. You got your jersey. You look good, good, man. Landon jogs with Brendan to the practice field. We do this every day if you want to. You wanna... <laughs> it's a game we play. Kick Landon. Coach Bruce Arena calls players over to meet Brendan, and he gets a big smile from the one and only David Beckham. How are you? Good. You okay? Yep. Welcome to training. One goal right there. <laughs> nice shot, nice shot. One goal for you. So you're kicking some goals. <laughs> yep. You scored more than me today. 
After Galaxy practice ends, it's one-on-one -on -one time for Brendan and Landon. <laughs> oh, now you're messing with the big guys. See, I don't take it easy on you like the other guys. Get off the post. <laughs> what a move. <laughs> Are you not tired yet? Not until I make this goal. You got more. Save. Oh, I had it. It's been a special day for Brendan, but Landon has an extra surprise. So those are all yours, buddy. And then one other thing I got for you. All right, so this is an all-access pass to our next game. Brendan, though, only has eyes for the ball. Yeah, he's like me, I'll never let the ball go. When I was your age, dude, I never lost the ball either. It was attached to my foot. It's Saturday night, moments before the Galaxy's game against the Portland Timbers. Brendan's in the tunnel, getting high fives from the whole team. Then Landon comes by, and in one exhilarating moment, the boy who spent last year on a pediatric cancer ward feels special in a new way. How are you? Good to see you. Have fun tonight, OK? OK. Only one thing could possibly make this wish any better. Landon's taking a PK right now. In a 3-0 Galaxy victory, Landon scores twice. And as he comes off the field after the win, he takes off his game jersey and gives it to Brendan. Hey, yeah, give me a hug, give me a hug, give me a hug, give me a hug. Yeah. Good job, you're a good luck charm. Yep, I want to think. It's a glorious end to a spectacular wish for young Brendan, newly inspired by his hero. Bye, Landon! Ah, thanks for everything, buddy. Brendan's now in remission, and his outlook is good. His dad says that when Brendan was in the hospital, he'd kick a soccer ball in the hallways, and the nurses would kick it right back to him. Learn more about Brendan and his wish. Log on to ESPN.com and search the words, My Wish.